Yeah! Hey, I'm back. It's uh, it's uh, Darren, and look what I got. I got me Mickey Lee Soapworks Lefty Verte. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Eric and Samantha McDaniels. Thank you very much. I whined long enough and hard enough, and they made a batch and sent me a uh, a nice tub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is uh, absolutely my hands down my favorite scent. Uh, this is in my uh, apocalypse soap apocalypse soap. Uh, I can't have. I cannot go without this. So some changes right off the bat. Nothing really changed inside. Uh, is as always. I can't describe this. Uh, it's sweet. It's kind of got some f little spice. Uh, maybe powdery to me. But everybody, everybody's nose is a little different. So I don't know exactly what their what their uh, scent profile is on this. But all I know it is my hands down my favorite. Here's the old packaging. Uh, you can see the black container with the brown here. And this is just about empty. Things were getting really serious. This is getting really low. Uh, now, <laughs> now I have this. So this is the new updated look. Uh, La Fiverte translates in French to the Green Fairy. And uh, as we can see, more slimline packaging. Packaging is important to a lot of people. Beautiful. And also in my box, I am was given Grand Havana alcohol splash to go along with this. So I'm gonna uh, I, I'm gonna do a little bit of a, a piff shave today. Um, I am gonna say again thank you to Anthony Esposito and my gold dollar shaver. Got a couple of straights, and I'm gonna tell you, keep going back to this. I like it. The other ones are nice, but I keep going back to this one. Um, La Fille Verte. Anybody knows Mickey? Everyone who knows Mickey Leaf so soap works, um, which I have a few of their soaps. It lathers like a champion. No effort whatsoever. I did do a little bit in a bowl here just to uh, ahead of time on, on the just to save some time. But I mean. Little bit of this stuff goes a long way. I mean, I really didn't have to load much on it. Oh man, I can't wait to do this. So I'm gonna uh, get a little bit of a damp cloth going here. I'm gonna use. Uh, they always use a uh, a pre. I am going to be using the uh, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements uh, Ice. Uh, pre, I used to use Parasso pre. Then I tried, I ran out, and then I tried Noxzema. Got a big giant tub of it. Don't really care for that. And uh, so I got this. Smells like Parasso. I don't know about the performance though. Still kind of on the shelf with it, and not even know if I'm using it right. So Doug, if you're watching this, which I'm going to tag you in it. Let me know, but we're not here to talk about this. We had to talk about Mickey Lee Soapworks. I, uh, I did send uh, the McDaniels a message and, and uh, ask if there was anything special that they wanted me to say and, uh, before I did the videos, but uh, I guess the time change out there, they're in California, I'm in uh, Boston. So I'm gonna tag uh, Samantha and if there's anything that she wants to add into this video, she can, so I've got the pre-worked in there. And uh, my trusty old plain badger pocket brush that I've used forever. Last time I made a video, there was uh, like 18 feet of snow up here in New England. That's all gone, thanks. So go ahead, Patriot fans, or Patriot uh, bashes. Go ahead, give it to me. Yep. Yeah. Go ahead. Deflate. Whatever. Doesn't matter. We're going to win a fifth one.
but right off the bat, I mean, you can see how quick this lathered up, and it's probably a little thick. I might, I might uh, for the straight, I might uh, add a little bit of water to it, but I want to read the ingredients here. Steric acid, tallow, tallow based soap, I think that's probably why I like it so much. Coconut oil, coconut milk, potassium hydroxide, sodium hydroxide, castor oil, glycerin, shea butter, lanolin, and fragrance. The secret ingredient right there, the fragrance, which I can't figure out. I'm just not that, uh, my nose is just not that, that uh, tricky to, to pick up on all that stuff. So uh, here we go. It is a tad thick, but that's okay. Because I gotta tell you what, you know what this stuff is? It's really slick. Uh, one of the things other than the um, other than the scent that I'm that I'm fond of of Mickey Lee Soap Works is the the slickness of the soap. And uh there we go. Try another pass. Who says gold bottles don't shave? It's another thing that's turning me off lately, all the drama. What's up with that? What is this? Junior high? Knock it off. Samantha, if you're watching this, you could make a bar soap of this too for me. <laughs> I wouldn't complain. I do have a little bit left in this uh, puck. I may, may, I might try that. Just uh, bear with me here. Yeah? Mickey Lee Soap Works. So let me uh, rinse this off here and we're going to move on to the, the alcohol splash. I was told to keep this a secret. We've actually been in, uh, we've actually had this for a couple of weeks. Nobody was supposed to know. Look at that. One pass. 
and I'm going to do another one, but for the sake of the video. Could do a little better up here, but I'm still learning with the straight. I'm not perfect with it by any means, but I'm certainly better than I was. And again, this is this is Grand Havana alcohol splash, and um, I should have probably checked um, if this stuff was available on their website. Um, if it is, go to MickeyLeeSoapWorks.com um, and see if this is available. I mean, if it's not, they have all kinds of great things. You just heard my dog; she has gives us the uh, seal of approval. So the alcohol splash. I did try this before, and yeah. They're not fooling around with this. This definitely is going to give you the burn. So uh, I'm going to spray it right into my hand here. Kind of. I almost want to say it, and, and I mean to me, and I could be wrong, but tobacco, kind of, maybe, not a very good reviewer, am I? <laughs> anyway, uh, all I know, hands down, this is my absolute favorite, favorite soap. Give this a try, guys. Uh, I know this, everybody's got a ton of soaps out there, but uh, you know, this is the second time around uh, for the release of this, and I begged and begged and begged and pleaded, please, 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 everybody, and they made a batch. So give Mickey Lee Soapwork some support with this. Try this, guys. You'll like it. I honestly and truly, you won't be let down by this. And if there's anybody out there watching this that wants me to uh, put them a sample of this, I will definitely do that and get it out to you um, so you can try it. And... Uh, Grand Havana alcohol splash. Yeah, that's definitely a tobacco-y to me. I like it. All right, that's it. Make Lee Soapworks. See you.